Hello, this video will guide you on how you can explore different versions of the Scrambler kit. And build your own Scrambler by selecting different parts and create your own version. We recommend to explore the kits using computer or laptop or any big screen so you can understand the parts and variations better and it can make your purchase experience different. Once you land on our website, you can either directly click on the shop button which will direct you to the Scrambler Kits page, or you can hover over this shop section and click on the Royal Enfield Classic Parts or Royal Enfield Electra Bullet Parts. Once you click on that it'll direct you to the product page where you can see all the Scrambler versions of products. Now let me give you some information about these products. The first is Build Your Scrambler, where you can build your own version by selecting or combining the parts you like and it gives you the liberty to play with all the parts we are offering for the Scrambler version. Other than this, there are Scrambler version 1, version 2 and version 3 in which you'll get some specific list of part to select from. Respective of particular versions look. Please note here that prices are showing zero in all the versions as you have to select the parts you want and it'll show you the prices as per that. Let me also explain differences between these three versions. Version 1 comes with two separate seats, which we call solo seat and pillion seat. These seats fits directly to the frame and you can easily remove the pillion seat to use rack plate and carrier to carry luggage while riding solo. Version 2 comes with the same seats like version 1, but it'll not fit directly to the frame and comes with the seat cowl which fits on the frame. Rest everything remains same like version 1 where you can easily remove pillion seat and use rack plate and carrier to carry luggage. Version 3 comes with a dual seat which fits directly to the frame and we call it seat on frame. Please note that you cannot fit rack plate or carrier if you are using this seat setup. Now let's head over to build your scrambler and I'll guide you how you can build your scrambler and place an order for the same. Let's take a look at the picture it's showing here, it's the Royal Enfield Classic equipped with our mainframe integrated with LED taillight and rear indicators, muffler, handlebar, bar busters, headlight grille, windshield mount, gaiters, bash plate and foot pegs. Rest of the parts like seats, rack plate, carrier, Cowl and mudguards you get chance to play with here and check how these different parts will affect the design and it'll help you decide what's best for you. Meanwhile if you want to check the pictures of different version, you can explore all the pictures here. You can also explore all the pictures here in scrambler section. Now let us start understanding different options available here. First of all you have to select your motorcycles model here. As this kit is compatible with Classics, Bullet, Electra and Standard models. You can select here whichever motorcycle you have. In this case let us select Classic model. Now next option is for the main frame which is mandatory part. You can see there are four parts listed as a mandatory part. First is main frame. Second is a tail light and rear indicators. Third is seat. Fourth is pillion option. As these are mandatory parts, you have to select them and you cannot proceed further without selecting any of these parts. In the rest of the parts, you get selection option if you want to add them or not. Now as the main frame is mandatory part, you have to select its finish here. We have three options for the main frame finish here, which are glossy black, rough black and matte black. Please note here that rough black is a texture or rough finish, which we recommend, as it can bear good amount of wear and tear for the longer period of time keeping the motorcycles off-road or touring usage in mind. Options are also showing price of this particular part here, and once you select any, it'll update the final cost which you can see at the top. Now next option is for tail light and rear indicators, and its casing which also a mandatory part. As its mandatory part you have to select this and you cannot proceed further without selecting this part. Once you select this it'll update the cost and you can move to select the seat option. Now for the seat you have three options here. Solo seat, solo seat with cowl and dual seat on frame. To understand these options better, you can select these parts one by one and check this picture, 
it which will show you how the selected part will look on the bike. Let us select solo seat first and proceed for the further option. Next option is for selecting pillion seat. In this you get three options to select from. One is only pillion seat. Second is only rack plate. Third is both the pillion seat and rack plate. And if you have selected dual seat on frame in previous seat option, then you have to select not applicable option, as you cannot use pillion seat or rack plate with dual seat on frame. To understand these options better, you can select these parts one by one and check this picture, which will show you how the selected part will look on the bike. Now if you select both the pillion seat and rack plate option, it'll show you an image combining two bikes. Top bike is equipped with solo seat and rack plate. Bottom bike is equipped with solo seat and pillion seat. This means that you can achieve both the looks and functionalities of the showing bikes here. You can anytime easily remove your pillion seat and use the rack plate or vice versa. Let us select rack plate option and move to selecting mudguards. Here for the mudguards you get seven options to select from. We are providing two different shapes for the mudguards. Square and round. You can explore the pictures to get the closer look of both the shapes. From the options you can either select front and rear square shaped mudguards. Or front and rear round shaped mudguards. Or only front square shaped mudguard. Or only front round shaped mudguard. Or only rear square shaped mudguard. Or only rear round shaped mudguard. Or if you do not require the mudguards, then you can select this not required option, as it's not mandatory part. Let's say if you have selected front and rear square shaped mudguard option, and you want to rethink over seat or pillion option, then you can also play with these different options here, and it'll show you the exact images of how different combinations or versions will look like. For an example, if you want to rethink over selected seat option, or how any other seat option will look with this selected mudguards. Then you can just scroll over the seat option and select any different option, which will show you exact image of how that combination will look. You can also do the same for the pillion option and check all the combination for the better understanding of different versions and select the correct parts as per your requirement. Now let's move to the next option, which is for the rack plate carrier. You get three options here. First is add rack plate carrier. Second is do not add. Third is not applicable for dual seat on frame. If you select the option add rack plate carrier, then you can see an updated image here with the rack plate carrier. You can also play with different previous options as well to check the combinations. If you have selected dual seat on frame in the previous seat option, then this carrier will not be applicable and you have to select not applicable for dual seat on frame. Please note here that to check different looks or combinations you can play with these four options of selecting seat, selection pillion option, selecting mudguards and selecting carrier, which will show you configurator type images here as per the selected options. You can also take a look at updated price here once you select any option. Please note here that this configurator type images are only limited to these four options and for the rest of the options left. It'll not show you different images, as per what you select like these previous four options, and you can check picture section to check how those parts will look on the bike. Now let us move to the next option, which is for the seat cover finish. You get two options here, black and brown. Please note that any seat you select will come with one inch parallel stitching pattern. You can explore pictures section to check the pattern. Next option is for mudguard finish. In this option you get most of the colors covered and you can select the color as per your motorcycle's color or as per your need. Next option is for cowl finish. This option is only applicable if you have selected solo seat with cowl in the previous seat option. If you have selected solo seat or dual seat on frame then select not applicable for solo seat and dual seat on frame. If you have opt for the solo seat with cowl then you can select the color as per your need. Next option is for the rack plate finish. In this you get the same options like the main frame finish selection 
and you can either select the same or different finish as per your need. For the next all the options like saddle stay, windshield with mounts, muffler, bash plate, foot pegs, headlight grille, bark busters, fork gaiters, hand lever, tires, number plate holder and fork brace. You can either add them or do not add as per your requirements. You can also check updated prices as you keep adding the parts. Once you add all the required parts in your cart, you can add it to bag and proceed for the checkout and place your order. Please note that if you have left selecting any option, then it'll not further proceed for the checkout and you have to select all the options. Now if we talk about version 1 and version 2, then only difference between these two versions is the seat cowl. Version 1 does not give you an option for the seat cowl while version 2 gives you an option for the seat cowl. Rest all the parts and options are the same. If we talk about version 3 then it comes with dual seat on frame which does not give you options of different solo and pillion seats as well as rack plate or carrier. Rest all the parts like mudguards, saddle stay, windshield with mounts, muffler, foot pegs, headlight grill, bark busters, fork gaiters, handlebar, tires, number plate holder and fork brace are same in all the versions. Hope this video will help you understanding the scrambler kit and parts better and if you have any further questions or doubts, you can email or WhatsApp us for the same. Thank you for watching this video and we wish you can do good off-road, trail and tour with this scrambler kit and find out a new adventure in life.